Now presenting RBNN, the Rosanna Brianna News Network on Channel 3, where the news is delivered straight from the source. Good afternoon everyone, I'm Rosanna, live with all BNN on Channel 3, reporting to you from Somalia, Africa. As you can see in this desert landscape, the grass is bare, and overall we are dealing with very harsh conditions. I'm going to talk to a civilian living nearby. Um, Abzmin, do you have any children? Are you married? Yes, I'm married and I, have, I currently have four children right now. I just had the youngest one the other day. Mm -hmm. uh, he's sick. I don't think he's going to survive. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. What, what is he sick with? He has pneumonia and it's quite common in infants around here. Mm -hmm. And a family few, few, a family few, a family few houses down. He just had a child, but he survived. Oh. But that's very rare here. My deepest apologies, Absalom. I wish only good fortune and health to you and your family. Thank you. Rosanna again live. Um, good afternoon. I am here with a lovely woman working for an organization here in Somalia. Um, and I hear that your organization is trying to improve conditions in Somalia. Is that correct? Yes. I'm here with the HEAL program, which stands for the Health and Ecosystems Analysis of Linkages. Can you tell me more about the HEAL program and your specific goals? The HEAL program is a global collaboration that works with public health and environmental conservation institutions to help understand the relationship between the state of ecosystems and public health outcomes. Our goal here is to provide prenatal care and education about maternal and child health care and to administer vaccines, particularly to the children. We hope that this will help reduce the child and infant mortality rates here. Wow, that's amazing. That was OBNN, the Rosanna Brianna News Network on Channel 3, where the news is delivered straight from the source. Thanks for watching and have a fantastic night, Worcester. Living in a developed world, it is hard to imagine deaths of this mass degree. However, as we go throughout our days, children are barely even given a chance at life. It is with the spread of awareness, help from outreach organizations such as the HEAL program, and donations from individuals that will allow us to work together to end this tragedy and allow each child the life that they deserve.